Hi everyone, my name is IDB. In this video, we will be talking about the causative or the causative verbs. What is the causative verbs? When we use causative verb in a sentence, so it means we cause someone to do something. Okay? It could be we persuade them, we ask them, we request them to do something or we let something to be happen. Later on, you will know in detail. All right, here I give you an example of a question. Would you like to send this letter for me? I am in a hurry. Don't worry, I will get my bang 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 it for you. Send, sends to send, sending. What is the right answer? Later on, you, you will know it. And what about how to construct them? What is the difference meaning among them? Yeah? What are the different meanings among them? All right? For word, let, and help, of course, we have known it exactly what is the different, right? But what about make, have, and get? You will know it. All right? Let's go to the number one. How to use a causative verb and what does it mean? Okay, number one, my father makes me, my father makes me blank, blank, blank his car. The main verb here is was. So, for causative make, we just use base form of the verb. Was. So, what is the meaning of make here? Alright, when someone makes us do something, it means they force us okay they force us to do something we have no choice right so make here could be force or to force all right next positive verb have his supervisor had him bang bang on sunday main verb work so again here we use base form yeah, his professor had him work on Sunday. All right. So when someone have us do something, it means they ask us. Okay, they request us to do something. Yeah. So have here as positive verb means to ask or ask. Okay. Ask or request yeah. they ask us politely okay that is for number two causative have now causative let my girlfriend lets me blame bring to her house the main book is calm so again here we also use base form of the verb calm yeah my girlfriend let lets me come to her house so when someone let us do something, it means that they give us permission to do something or they allow us to do something. All right. So here, let means allow or give. Give us permission. Okay. Give us permission. All right. We are going to number four, causative get. I will get my sister bring bring my laundry. The main book is do. So here, when we use causative get in a sentence, we have to use two infinitive. Okay? Two plus verb to do. All right. So, I will get my sister to do my laundry. So, when someone get us to do something, it means that they persuade us. Okay? Persuade. Okay. In Bahasa, it means membujuk or merayu. Okay? So, please notice here, we do, I'm, I'm sorry, we use two infinitive. Alright, the last one, the causative help, of course, we have no, 
we have known what is the meaning of help. Okay, example here, IDP channel has helped us, blank, 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 our English main verb is improve. So here we can use to infinitive, okay, has helped us to improve our English. And also we can use base form of the verb. Once again, IDP channel has helped us to improve or help help us improve our English. Okay, that is for causative help. All right. So all of this sentence here is active. I have written here is active causative. So what about positive causative? I will tell you in the next video of I mean I mean about this material the causative verb okay if you have any question please let me know and you can type it in comment column all right thank you very much for your time and see you next time goodbye